how to make an oil lamp when the grid is gone. Your batteries are fossils, and the night belongs to things with teeth. Darkness is no longer just the absence of light. It's a hunting ground, and you are very much on the menu. So let's make some fire you can actually control. First, find a non-flammable container, a glass jar, a tin can, your least favorite coffee mug. Now for the fuel. Any old fat or oil will do. Cooking oil from a looted kitchen, melted animal fat, even the oil from a can of ancient fish. Pour it into your container. Don't fill it to the top unless you enjoy being on fire. Now for the part that separates a lamp from a Molotov cocktail, the wick. Subscribe and I'll show you how to not set yourself on fire. Okay, good. You need a natural fiber, like cotton from a t-shirt or a shoelace. Soak your cotton wick in the oil until it's completely saturated. You need to secure it so just a little bit pokes out of the oil. A piece of wire twisted around it or fed through a hole in a metal lid works best. The science here is capillary action. The fibers of the wick act like a tiny fuel pump, drawing the oil up to the flame to be vaporized and burned. Now, light the tip. If it's a steady, smoky flame, congratulations! You've just painted a tiny flickering target on your back. 